Two seniors from the Anoka Hennepin School District are hoping for a prestigious scholarship. They are semifinalists for a National Merit Scholarship. Delane Cleveland introduces us to the semifinalist from Champlin Park who uses his knowledge to help others. An orchestra has dozens of performers. Yet each musician works together to make a beautiful piece of music. One of the faces in this group is Jake Coonan. It's something that I wasn't that good at until recently, and just the more the more I play, the more I can like the better I can get. But music isn't the only thing at which this Champlain Park senior excels. Since there's no net force, what does the upward force of tension have to be? And it's also not the only time you'll find him working with others to make good things happen. I'm five of the students that I had last year in AP Calculus approached me about setting up a math tutor center in my room after school. Yes, this aspiring engineer has a passion for math and he uses his knowledge to tutor students in both algebra and calculus. Some of them have been staying till five o'clock at night, so sometimes two and a half hours after school helping other students and they're very engaged and interested in how the other students are d learning and progressing and how they're doing on their assignments and tests. It's cool to help the other people, like when you explain it, it helps you understand it better as well. How would you draw a free body diagram of this system? Understanding a subject matter hasn't been much of a problem for Jake. Really most of it is just um, paying attention during class. Paying attention in class helped him earn a 4.1 GPA. He's also the only student at Champlain Park who was named a National Merit semifinalist. I'm very proud of him, but it's, it's not surprising. It was, it's completely expectable um, based on who he is. At Champlain Park, Delaney Cleveland, 12 News. Jake hasn't committed to a college yet, but his number one choice is the University of Minnesota. He'll find out whether he wins a National Merit Scholarship this spring.